phone and called him Angus. He said, John, I have a fighter for you. And I said, okay, what's his name? He told me Sergey Kovalev, which I forgot as soon as he told me who he was. A few days later, Sergey arrives. We didn't understand each other because I had a very bad English at that time. The lines of communication, they're not really that good. I said, come to the gym tomorrow, we work out. Come the next day, disastrous. <laughs> you know, Sergey is his own guy. He likes to do things his way. Well, I'm a teacher, I'm gonna do things my way. You're in my gym now. Yeah, well, you know, training wasn't as well as I wanted to go. I mean, like I said, Sergey is his own person. He, and he has his own ideas. So we clashed. I said, man, I don't want to train this guy. I tried. He's just a little bit too difficult. I told my assistant, I said, listen, after this fight, it's over. Originally from Chelyabinsk, Russia. But the funny thing happened that night in the, in the, in the arena. He did everything that I asked him to do. He, he dispatched Darnell Boone the way I wanted him to. Nice and easy. So I'm walking back with my assistant, Derek Santos, and I said, you know what? Remember all that trash I was talking these past few weeks? I said, cancel all that. This guy can fight. He's going to be champion of the world. Beautiful work. Another round of thanks. Watch his head. Move your head, OK? With each passing fight, we, I guess, begin to trust more of each other. One, two, three. There you go. Good roll. I don't know how for John, maybe I'm very difficult back, uh, person, you know. Now I ask to John what I want and what I see, how to work against my next opponent. It's like a compliment, compliment each other. Four years removed from those early difficulties, tonight Sergei Kovalev and John David Jackson enter the ring together for the 12th time. And with the rematch against John Pascal looming, the trainer offers a blunt assessment of the brand new partnership in the opposing corner. Once Pascal gets hit by the punch that, that Sergey's gonna hit him with, he's gonna revert back to whatever he did before he met with Freddie Roach. Because they don't have enough time for, for Freddie to really implement what he needs to upon Pascal to become a better fighter, if that's at all possible. The first fight with Sergey took a lot out of him. So the second fight, trust me, there, there won't be much left with him. The one thing Freddie may be able to do is to show this kid how to survive a little bit longer. But you know, the longer the fight goes, the more of a beating he's gonna take.